the Overhead Phototherapy MTTS V3000. The MTTS V3000 is an overhead LED phototherapy unit. In this video, you will learn how to install and operate the V3000. The first section will cover installation, and the second section will cover operation. Slowly open the box and remove the top piece of styrofoam. Remove all items from the box and lay them in front of you. There will be seven pieces. The overhead unit, the three parts for the stand, the base, the lower stand and upper stand. A power cord, a set of curtains and the user manual. To assemble the device, you will need a size 14 wrench. Now you are ready to install the device. To begin, you will need to assemble the stand. Start with the base and the lower stand piece. All of the screws and bolts will be in place, but we need to remove them first for assembly. Remove all the screws and bolts and place them to the side. Keep each set together to help you remember what's going where. Now align the bottom stand piece with the base, making sure that the black knob faces away from the base. Make sure the holes for the bolts are lined up. Now it's time to put the bolts back in and secure the base. Put the thin washer on the bolt and place it in the hole. Do that for all four bolts. Now that the bolts are in place, put the remaining thin washer onto each bolt, followed by the spring washer. Finally, screw the, the nut onto the bolt. Repeat through the remaining three bolts. Once the bolts are all in place, use the size 14 wrench to tighten the nuts. If you like, you can use a second wrench to hold the bolt in place. Now connect the remaining piece of the stand. First, remove the screw that is in the middle of the stand. Next, unscrew the black knob all the way, but do not remove it. Then unscrew and remove the height locking nut at the top of the pole. There will be a plastic ring clamp inside the height locking nut. Now take the top stand piece and slide the height locking nut onto the piece with the rounded edge facing the white arm. Then take the plastic ring clamp and place it on the stand piece with the narrower end facing upwards towards the height locking nut. Now insert the top stand piece into the bottom stand piece, making sure that the arm portion is parallel to the middle bar of the base. Tighten the height locking nut. Now tighten the black knob. Once the stand piece is in place, reinsert the screw. Make sure the washer is on the screw and then insert the screw into the hole in the bottom stand piece. If it does not go all the way in, gently swivel the upper stand piece until the screw can be fully inserted. Screw in the bolt on the other side of the stand. Now we're going to attach the overhead unit. Before you start, make sure to lock the wheels. Press the on side of the lock towards the ground to engage the lock. There are two wheels that lock. Make sure to lock both. Now unscrew the silver sleeve ring on the arm of the upper stand piece 
and remove it. Place it to the side. Now it's time to attach the overhead unit. Hold the unit with one hand on each of the shorter sides of the unit. Make sure the bulb side is facing the floor and the side with the logos facing towards you. Slide the unit onto the upper stand piece and secure it by tightening the silver sleeve ring. Now the main assembly is complete and you can attach the power cord. Plug the power cord into the back of the overhead unit. And then plug the other end into the power source. The device is now ready to use. To start using the V3000, prepare the baby by ensuring that the baby is not covered by blankets or clothes other than a diaper or diaper cloth and eye covering. It is important that babies receiving phototherapy wear a protective eye mask or patch during the entire time they are exposed to the phototherapy light. Once the baby is ready, place the device over the baby bed. The base fits neatly under an MTTS bed but can be used with most types of beds. The overhead unit should be between 30 and 40 centimeters away from the baby. We will address how to adjust the height of the unit later in this video. To turn on the device, simply press the power button at the front of the overhead unit. When the device is on, the display screen will light up the display tells you two pieces of information. For the first three seconds after you turn on the device, the display will indicate the number of hours that the V3000 has been used since its manufacture. This machine has been used for a total of one hour. After three seconds, the total use number disappears and the display will begin to show the counter for the current treatment session. The device counts up from zero and displays the time in seconds, minutes and hours. The counter restarts every time the V3000 is turned off and on. Now let's go over a few features of the device. For extra intensity, you can use the boost option. To engage the boost option, press the green button. The lower green light will light up. When you turn on the boost option, the display screen will show the total number of hours the boost mode has been used. This will display for the first three seconds. The display then returns to timing the duration of the current treatment session. To turn off the boost option, press the green button again and the upper green indicator light will light up again. If you would like to use curtains during phototherapy, you can attach the four curtains that come with the V3000. The overhead unit is equipped with metal pegs on each side from which you can hang the curtains as shown. Do not cover the top of the overhead unit with curtains or anything else. Covering the top of the unit with cloth or any other materials can cause the V3000 to overheat. Now we'll go over how to adjust the height of the overhead unit. You need two people to adjust the height. First, unscrew the height locking ring sleeve and the black knob. With each person on each side of the device, raise the height of the overhead unit. Once it reaches the desired position, tighten both knobs again to secure the device in place. The MTTS V3000 and the MTTS Radiant Warmer can be used together. To do this, place the overhead phototherapy device next to the warmer 
and adjust the angle of the overhead unit so that the patient is exposed to the LED light. It is very important that the phototherapy device does not come between the heater unit and the baby. By placing the overhead phototherapy at an angle from the side, we ensure that the phototherapy does not block the baby's exposure to heat and the heat does not damage the top of the overhead phototherapy.